All right, so one of the options for your first assignment is to create a conceptual mass. So um, I'm going to create one in this series. I just want to give you an example of what we're sort of going for. Basically, um, we have a rig. So let me hide the, um, the geometry here real quick. We have a rig that has a series of rectangles that have been blended together to create a solid. And those rectangles have parameters on them that control the width and the length. And then we also have a void in the middle that is a blend between a series of circles. All of these are hosted on points that are on a line that is also being controlled um, by a parameter. So we're going to set up all of these in the next um, series of videos. Let me go ahead and fix that temporary how to isolate. And really the goal is to get a rig that's controlling the geometry so you can make multiple iterations of your geometry. So for example, I'm opening up my family types dialog box that has all the parameters listed that are applied to various parts of it. And I have different types. So I have a 70 foot one and then I have a 60 foot one and if I, and I have a 40 foot one. And it's just a different setting for each one of these parameters, materials, the radius of the void circle, the height of the line, um, all that kind of stuff. So we're gonna, I'm gonna show you how to set that up in the next series of videos. Um,